Hi everyone, this is Kevin from Our Philippine American Adventure. Um, today I'm at work. I'm just preparing to go walk over to the bus, but I wanted to do a follow-up video today on a video I posted about six months ago concerning the lost kittens. I've been getting a lot of negative comments about that and I just want to clarify a few things. I shouldn't have to, but I'm going to just for the sake of it. Um, getting a lot of people calling me idiots, telling me to F off, and calling me douchebag and whatever. Well, I know these are trolls and I'm not really going to worry about them too much, but I just want to clarify some things. One, I was getting my motorcycle tire fixed that day, so I was on my motorcycle. So how am I going to take four kittens, you know, back to my house on a motorcycle? Number two... I was, um, we were preparing to leave in a couple days and my family wouldn't want kittens because they've already got enough cats and dogs as it is. As far as giving those kittens to another person, another family, you know, in the Philippines, some people are just struggling to put food on the table for um, family members, let alone animals. So before you ridicule me about not taking these pets in or trying to find a home for them. All of you guys need to get a life, accept reality, and you cannot take every stray that you run across in the Philippines into your home. You would be overrun by animals. So if you don't like the channel, you can just go ahead and unsubscribe. I probably wouldn't miss you that much. But there is reasons why people do things. And the reason I didn't take them in you know there was multiple reasons and I just explained some of them to you um, I would love to have kittens in the Philippines but we're go we go come and go you know every year we're there for two three months and then we come back home and I already have family members taking care of a dog of ours so while we're gone so and then another guy said someone took him to the U uh, Russian embassy and somehow got them out of the Philippines and took them to Russia and they lived 27 years you know and had kittens of their own well that's great if that's a true story you know hats off to this guy you know we all do our own thing which which is best for us so you know anyway I just wanted to rant about that for a little bit um, another three weeks we'll be heading to the Philippines so um, oh another thing you know if the mother was around there and then I took those cats, kittens somewhere, the mother's gonna be missing them. So, you know, before you call names to people, uh, why don't you think about it first? And uh, maybe you would handle it differently. Well, hats off to you. This is the way I handled it. And if I had it to do over again, I would do the same thing, okay? So anyway, that's it. Um, I'll probably only be doing maybe one or two videos over the next few weeks. I've been working a lot of overtime. I'm only part-time here, but I've been getting 30, 40 hours a week part-time over the last week or two because we are still busy and a lot of people call in sick and whatnot. But another three, three and a half weeks, we'll be heading over to the Philippines. So I look forward to doing more videos for you. I uh, hope you will enjoy them. Just be patient. Videos are coming. So we will talk to you guys really soon. Thanks for watching. And we'll be back. See ya. Bye-bye.